Okay, this is Coach Kevin Kennel. I'm here to talk to you about a hunted butterfly. The boy in the white cap is my swimmer, and it's a hunted short course. As he dives in, and this is in slow motion, but you can see the cursor going across. That blue line is his underwater to his breakout. Now he just hit his 15 meter time. You saw that line. All those dots are every time his hands are entering in front. So that's giving us a stroke rate and it's giving us the distance per cycle. And then eventually it's giving us the um, velocity as well. And so the yellow that you see on the left side of that second bar was his turn. And we'll talk more about that in just a little bit. So again, he's getting into his stroke rate and his rhythm. You can see he slows down a little bit going into that turn. And now you see the yellow on that third bar. That was the time his hands touched to when his feet pushed off. And again, we see the underwater. So this really tells you a lot of information. And by putting the video and linking it with this data here, they really begin to understand what these components mean. And it's just so much easier to get them to work on it in practice. And again, coming in here, you see that straight line going into the turn. He hit that pretty full stroke. And again, the yellow demo or shows you the uh, time on the wall. Hand touch to foot push. And now we're back on this last length. And here you can see that he's increasing his tempo a little bit and trying to find that wall on a full stroke. And he does slow down here just a little bit, you can see, but he does hit on a good full stroke. So that's pretty good. And now I'm going to show you just, I'm going to add a notes feature to this after we already stamped it. You can see that yellow note there, or the, excuse me, the white note up on the left hand side. We're going to play this in normal speed. It hits a note that I've inserted on those triangles there. And the next one's coming up towards the end of this length. And so everywhere that those orange triangles are, I inserted a note. Here you can see hit that on a full stride, so that's really good going into the turn. And so it gives the kids some things to look at that, that you're looking at, and they get a better understanding. Here, real good tempo, distance per stroke, keeping it long. And now, uh, here again, hitting on a good full stroke, it's what we're after. That turn, we're trying to keep it at 1.0 or faster. So this is just information that you can have there so that when they review their swim or when you review it with them, accelerate really good there. So it gives you more information that you can give them about each and, uh, each and every race. And you don't have to insert the notes, but it's an option that's there for you. And you do it after you've already done all the analysis, and then you can add those notes afterwards. And again, here at the finish, hit on a good full stroke. So by adding the notes on there, you can get a whole nother um, way that you can talk about these components. You can get the kids to really understand the strategy behind their race.